Hello, students and viewers. Um, I'm a little bit surprised to see this event still happening, this error still happening in people's writing, particularly when they're typing. Because you see, if I type into Microsoft Word and so many things, so the dog ran down the road. Now, I did not in fact put that capital letter there, but it certainly belongs there. The start of a sentence is just a way of telling your reader this is the start of a sentence. Always, always have it has a capital letter. Now, the reason that some of you don't do this is because you're running your sentences together. So the dog ran down the road, road, uh, the cat followed. Now, you actually need a capital T for the cat because that's actually the start of a new sentence. And I'll explain briefly why. Because um, that feels like a sentence to some people because one of those actions is connected to the other. So the first sentence, the dog ran down the road. So the dog is what that sentence is about, and what it did is it ran down the road. Now, the cat is a different actor, or a different subject, if you will, and what it did was it followed. Now, you cannot join these together with a comma, but, so you could make them two sentences, in which case that's where you need that capital, but if you decided that you were going to, for instance, join it together with a semicolon, then it all becomes the one sentence and you don't need a capital. And if you were going to put a conjunction in there, such as and, or but, or so, then you don't need a capital because you're not starting a new sentence. But you really need to be aware of where your sentences are starting and finishing. The only time you would not put a capital at the start of your sentence is something that is deliberately has a lowercase letter at the start of it. Now, if I write iPod, there you go. Microsoft Word actually doesn't understand that that's a, um, a brand name. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back and change it. iPod. So I might say iPods are very popular. Because you're kind of stuck between two rules here. That should start with a capital, but you actually change that name if you, you change it into something it isn't because the capitalization is part of it. What you do in this case is you work around it and say, the Apple iPod is a very popular device. So you just rewrite it, um, is very popular. So you rewrite it so that you don't have that unusual word that starts with a lowercase letter at the start of your sentence. And again, it is just a chance, it gives you, your reader that smooth journey of understanding what it is that you're talking about. So your sentences always, always start with a capital letter.